The Yu Vong and the many wars they waged across the galaxy far, far away are among some of the greatest Star Wars Legends tales ever put to paper. So much so that many of those who dislike the direction of the current sequel trilogy would much rather some kind of extra galactic invasion. Even if you are a fan of The Force Awakens and its highly controversial sequel, which is a big if at this point, I'm sure we can all agree that the Rebel Alliance fighting alongside the Galactic Empire, doing so against a common enemy, is a mouth-watering prospect. Unfortunately, a Yu Zanfong trilogy seems utterly out of the question as far as Disney are concerned. But what if we choose to switch our focus from the silver screen to the small screen? Might we ever see this savage and devastating species in a future Star Wars animated series? Well, let's find out. When it comes to resurrecting characters and storylines from the dark abyss that is Star Wars Legends, there is perhaps no better man to turn to than Dave Filoni. His work across Star Wars Rebels alone just goes to show that no concept is too unbelievable or grandiose for the canon timeline. So it's a very real possibility that we will see the Yuuzhan Vong in one of Filoni's future works, maybe even as early as the rumoured sequel trilogy era animated series. But if you think that's an exciting prospect, then prepare to have your mind blown. During 2015's celebration in Anaheim, Dave Filoni and Pablo Hidalgo revealed some of the storylines that would have featured in Star Wars The Clone Wars had it not been cancelled. And while some of these ideas were later developed into novels or released as unfinished episodes, many more simply fell by the wayside. Whether it be an unlikely pairing between Cad Bane and Boba Fett, a look at Yoda's strong connection with the Wookiees, a conflict between clone pilots and Grinch troops, more of Ahsoka Tano following her departure from the Jedi Order, or the discovery of a Sith Shrine and giant kaiju-like creature beneath the streets of Coruscant, Filoni and his team were clearly all set for an epic sixth season. But perhaps their most intriguing and certainly most risky idea came in the form of reintroducing a species from the non-canon expanded universe the Yu Zanfong. Dave Filoni couldn't stress enough how somewhat low-key the invasion was going to be, claiming there would have been only one warrior accompanied by one scout ship. However, given their intention to assess the Jedi, it's fair to say the Yu Zanfong's role in the Clone Wars could and would have developed into something rather substantial. So there we have it, how the Yu Vong very nearly made it into Star Wars Clone Wars. Let me know your honest opinion of the extra galactic species, as well as your thoughts on this abandoned idea, by leaving a comment down below. If you learned something new from today's video, be sure to leave a like. And for weekly behind the scenes content, press that subscribe button and notification bell to keep it locked here. To the Kangasans.